I think, um, first of all, we're disappointed, obviously, with the result. Um, we missed a great opportunity to, to get into the, the run for the playoffs. And um, two goals, two mistakes. Uh, at this point in the season, those mistakes are costly. And you saw that tonight. Um, we gave up an early goal. And, and then in the second goal, also give the ball away. We were looking for the foul. And, and they come in and they, they, they punish us. Thank you. Uh, next question will go to Kobe Price. Kobe, you're off mute. Appreciate it, Jackie. Hey, Victor. Uh, how's it going? I've, Just, been better, uh, I've been better, man. I came. I'm not going to lie. Fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, we just spoke with Diego, and he mentioned he didn't like the start to the game. And then, obviously, there's the goals that you guys allowed. How, I guess, how can you explain the sluggish start that you guys had, knowing, coming into the game, knowing that this is a big game for the playoff contention? Thank you. Yeah, no, great question. Sometimes it's, it's difficult to to answer some questions. Um, we were prepared for the game. We were mentally in. We knew the situation that we were in, and they're directly above us. We knew that if we won, we, we would jump them in the standings, and we prepared well, really. Uh, we, we knew we, we were going to fight a final, and, and we got off to such a bad start, I think. Uh, mentally, we just have to be cued in from, from the get-go. Um, I think we had a great warm-up. Um, I can't really come up with, with any excuses. It was just not good enough from the get-go. And I think it took us a little bit, 20, 25 minutes, to get into the game, really, and to start getting those those chances. And I think the end of the first half was was positive for us. Um, again, kind of a slow start in the second half. And then we make a mistake that that cost us dearly for, for the race in, in, this, in this run. Thank you. Uh, we'll take one more question from Franco. Franco, you're off mute. Thank you, Jackie. Hey, Victor, uh, I, I have two questions for you. The first one's a little more tactical um, with regards to the first half. You guys obviously got off to the slow start, like you've mentioned, like others, uh, my other colleagues have mentioned. Um, and we saw Lewis, who normally predominantly plays on the right, he kind of started playing as like a secondary striker. He was, he was drifting um, through, on the left, in the middle, a little at times on the right, but he was all, all over the attack. It looked like he was playing behind uh, Gonzalo there in, in that first half. Um, but what did Diego ask of you guys as a team there um, in, in that first half? And the second one is a little bit kind of related to, to that um, because I assume the idea was to, to improve in the attack. But the second one is you guys as a team um, have scored 19 goals in, in 19 games. Um, so that's an average of, of a goal per game. Um, why is it? Why do you think that the attack has struggled to, to score goals and, and to, to make it count? Obviously, there's breakdowns today on, on the defensive side, but I, for me, just my opinion, I think on the defensive side, you guys put in the work, you guys press, you guys, obviously there's going to be breakdowns that happen, but the attack needs to kind of help you get out of, the, out of those situations and, 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 and beat the opponent. So why is it, why do you think the attack has struggled? Do you guys need more variety in, in the way you attack? Obviously you guys predominantly attack down the wings and look for crosses towards the middle, but what, why do you think that is, uh, Victor? Thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, no, two, two great questions. The first two, your first question was just tactical. Uh, we started off a certain way, playing in a certain formation. And once we Diego got a feel of the game, he he felt that it was better to switch it up. So then we went with, like you mentioned, Lewis as a sec, second striker. Uh, and we went with the back three and then with the wing, our wing backs high. So we, we knew that the game, we had more spaces on on our, if we switched to the point of attack quickly, Dylan and, and Breck had space and time on the ball. And, and so that, that's why that was the change. Um, to your second question, I think that offensively is the hardest part to, to digest, to dissect. Um, I think it's, a, it's, it's just we're missing that last final pass. Uh, we're creating opportunities. We're getting into the last third. It's not that we're not getting shots. We're also getting shots. And, but I, I think sometimes that, that last pass, just we're missing that last final pass and, and then the, the confidence to make it um, just so that we can start scoring more goals. Uh, Unfortunately, tonight we, we weren't good enough and we needed to create more opportunities. And that's kind of how our season has been. Um, we're just lacking sometimes that, lap, that last pass. The, the ball hasn't really bounced our way. And, and I mean, we take the positives from everything. We have four games left and we're going to try to push and, and try to make a playoff run again. Victor, thank you so much for your time. Thank you, guys.